Welcome back to Bay Area Sling Riders. So I've been showing lately, I've been doing a lot of upgrades to my bike and I'm getting ready to install the audio system. And I installed the um, Trace LED um, Underglow. And one guy said, hey man, did you get the F7, FZ1 accessory panel, um, fuse panel? And I did. Oh! So let me walk you through it, pros and cons of it show you how easy it was to install how it looked and so let's go here now this here is the actual unit okay the actual unit now i've already got it installed and it's already um screwed down but the actual unit comes and it's this uh i can show you a picture of it it's just a block and inside you run a ground and a 12 volt lead battery now you want to run it straight from the battery because what this allows you to do is gives you 12 volts fuse lines out from the battery so actually let's start on the battery in this is the battery now the battery i'm upgrading have a new battery on order but this is the positive side of the battery now when you order the actual kit it comes with the fuse block and then it also has an accessory wire kit that I highly suggest you get because it gives you wire etc. Now I believe it's ranked up to I think it's a 60 amps total 30 amps 60 amps but you take the positive end and you run to the positive terminal and then you take the negative end and you run that to the negative side of the battery guys guys do not pull from a chassis ground reason you don't want to do that a couple things first of all with a um, slingshot you get a chassis uh, error a lot it throw a lot on your uh, it's really picky with grounds but more importantly the grounding system in a slingshot is really really weak they run a small cable for ground to the actual body to the engine and also to the alternator everything needs to be stepped up we talk about that later that's called the big three but you want to take your ground and your power both from the battery I read it inside wire loom. Wire loom, okay? Up along here, come along here, and over to the block. Down in the wire loom, comes up, and bam. Now what I have it running right now is actually my underglow. So, and I wish I could show you this guys, and if you need me, I could take it off. But under this here, so on each side, your ground goes in one side and your positive goes in the other side you can label them each one so only have one it's not labeled now inside what makes it so valuable is it's just by jumping a switch i can make this a constant 12 volt or a switch 12 volt now you ask why why is that so such a good thing now a lot of guys when they wire stuff if they grab a switch 12 volt from ignition somewhere in ignition to cigarette lighter and it which is great because normally you use a switch just to turn on something like an amplifier but what if you're running something a little bigger application like you actually want to run some fog lights that you don't want to go to the household of turning off and on but you want them to come on when your ignition start oh my that's where this comes in because using something like this which is a relay it's going to pull the main feed off and based on the jumper on a switch 12 volts which means there's no popping cigarette lighters you can actually run something with some real current now this was i believe um 99 dollars and um a little box here that's hollow i want to need to check it it's real secure now when i run my uh when I add anything to it, you know what I mean? If I want to add some interior LEDs, I want to add some strobes, so we'll, anything I take here, I'm just going to go straight here. I can get a, a 12 volt hot straight from the battery, a 12 volt hot switch ignition straight from the battery. I have to worry about anything. I have to worry about my fuse, my internal wire, and none of that stuff. Guys, for the ease of use and, and just the 
the the peace of mind knowing that I'm not gonna blow out anything and trying to find fuses and go under panels and stuff it's well worth it right oh actually I can show you real quick all I had to do was stick the lights and tap into my positive and ground and I'm good there you guys go